Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I just want to make a couple of notes. One, there's lots of reasons, lots of compelling state interest reasons that the legislature will set the statute of limitations in any cause of action. Uh, without spelling them all out on the floor, we talked about some of them. Uh, there are other reasons, but I'll just say it's also not that difficult to file these claims. But more importantly, it's not difficult um, for that initial letter that you have to submit. And if you don't believe me, just go on Google and search Department of Financial Services. And for example, you know, a lot of negligence claims are going to involve uh, motor vehicles owned and driven by government employees. And you can go and look at the automobile accident report, which would be sufficient because all you really have to do is submit a narrative letter describing the facts and nature of the claim. And, and I'll tell you, it's about a three-page form. And it, you go and look at the form, and it's basically something you would see in elementary school to describe an accident. There's an intersection drawn on the form. You draw in your little cars, give a short description of the event. And that's just an example of something that would be acceptable to substantiate uh, that requirement. It's not a high bar, and two years is a long time to consider, hire an attorney if you think you need one, and file these claims. I hope that you'll be up on this bill.